Hi friends, this is Gail O'Neill, and I teach stamping. I hope you enjoy. And Barb and Patricia and Donna. Hi Dawn and Victoria. So glad you could all join me tonight. Um, this is going to be my last live until I'm settled in Florida. I may pop on with a little coloring, but yeah, it's getting a little difficult. And uh, things got packed yesterday that I didn't know got packed because I had a friend over here helping me, two friends. And um, yeah, so tonight's going to be kind of quick, although I'm always quick. So let's get started. So do you remember these little coffee cups and Stampin' Up! demonstrators? A few years ago, we went crazy making them. So what we had to do was take one apart and then make a pattern. And then you had to fussy cut everything and everybody had to fussy cut it. So Trinity Stamps came out with a, let me see if I can find the package, with a die set. It's got all these other little extras that I haven't played with yet. But it's got the die for it. And it's got the belly band. And of course, I wanted to do one with my little crinkler, but it's packed. So my embossing powders are packed. I'm like, hmm. So as of tomorrow, everything but my markers are going to be packed. So I might pop on at some point just coloring some digis. And that just hit the floor. But I do have a floor again. So let's do couple I've cut out a few different patterns oh and here was the other thing so I knew where this was that I had from years ago but either the tops got packed <laughs> or I might have tossed them not realizing I still had these but I do have three of them so you know we can rotate but I'm making two so this was from the Christmas is Gleaming. And if you're doing any kind of pattern, um, you have to make sure that you put your die down in the right direction so that this is on the top. So the first time I did the snowmen, of course I had it backwards. <laughs> what, what else would you do? So I did this one and, and you could do either either way but I wanted this. So what we're gonna do is take our tape. Let's see if I can bring the whole thing over, make it a little easier. And you know who this is from. Mm-hmm, Crafter's Solutions. So it can hold all your rolls of tape and a few little other extras there. So let me try and so I'm going to put a piece of tape on each side. Hi, Lou. And then I'm going to put one in the middle and you can also put um, some wet glue. If you want to on the first one, I put it like all around, but. I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna put a little, little there. <gasps> really? Fingers not working as usual. Look at this, I have no nails. I put a little nail polish on, but my nails are gone. But I couldn't let them look like yours, Lou. <gasps> that was mean. You don't have to say it. Hi, Robin. Let's see. I see Marty. I see Linda. I see Robin. I don't see Lou. Okay. So then, so now on one edge, it cuts it rounded. So this is going to be your, your outer. So we're just going to roll that like that. And then bring this one like 
like so. Isn't that pretty? I love this paper. So then you can do a belly band, and the belly band goes the same way, like that. So I think I will put it on. Um, do I want it to the back? You can tell I really didn't plan this. So I think I'll put it to the front and then put my piece over it. Okay, so I want a little piece on each. So I'm going to do the same thing, put one in the middle. And now that I'm thinking of it, because this is just about an exact fit, I'm not sure if putting it through the crinkler, if it would then make it too small. To make it really look like a coffee cup thing. And I have such a cold, I think I caught it from Dawn from her live, or she caught it from me, because really mine started yesterday. I could burnish it, it would make it easier. Okay, so I said I wanted that in the front. So I'm going to put that about there. There's still okay. So then I thought we would stamp joy on that, and I would have embossed it, but you know, it's packed. So let's stamp that. Hi, Jacqueline. Stephanie. I left it there. Gosh, Gail. All right, so I'm going to cut this in half. And put a little there. Yeah, that'll work. And I probably should have put a little bit of ink around that. Oh, what are you scared for? Hi, baby girl. Your little chicken. This is her new thing, really, coming in here when I'm live. I should have used the tape so it would dry quicker. But we got time. See, now I'm not going to be as quick as I normally am. Dry. There's, oh, I'm going to put it on that. All right, so I think I will put see, I like being more prepared, but I'm really a slug today. Go, Daddy. Go on. Go on. What? You want to say hello? Oh, your baby. Okay, so we're going to put that there. Oh, and I was going to color too. Huh. All right, so let's do that. So I've got this stamp also from Christmas is gleaming and a piece of white cardstock so we're gonna turn it over we're gonna stamp it in black
And then I'm going to use Old Olive and Light Mossy Meadow. And then the reds. So we've got Light and Dark Real Red and then light cherry cobbler. So let's see how that works out. So I'm going to take the mossy meadow I might want to switch to the darker one. Let's see. This is the old olive. Yeah, the old olive the star. So we're just going to use the two colors. So I'm going to go in on the bottom. Maybe I'll bring the dark mossy meadow. I think I will. Dark. Where'd it go? It's hiding. It left. Wow, oh, that's better. Okay. So we'll do a little bit more of the old olive. Oh, she's really laying down next to me. This is going to be some trip with her. She hates being in the car. So do I. that to blend a little better. Okay, and then let's do the light and the dark, and then I'll add the cherry cobbler. Or not. I'm not sure. So then this is the light. Yeah, I'm going to bring in that darker one. I'm really getting used to my other markers. Right out of the line. We'll see if I can fix that. Light mossy meadow. Good job, Gail. All right, so let's, well, I'm going to cut it out. Red is the worst to try and fix. But I'll do something. I'll do something. That's probably cut out good enough. What do you think? And 
Great job, beautiful. <laughs> Even when I'm messing up. And my neck. My neck falls like feels like it's going to fall off my body from carrying things I shouldn't be carrying. But my two friends yesterday, the one was here in the stamp room, Joyce, and she's like, I think I'm only moving things from one place to the other. Like, I, I don't think I'm doing anything. Well, while she was moving things from one place to the other, Iris was packing them. Because <laughs> I was like, oh, that's gone. That's gone. That's gone. So, yeah, they accomplished a lot. Still a lot more to go. My other moves were so much easier because you could just take a car full and bring a little bit over at a time. Yeah, that can't happen from here to Florida. Okay, so then I'm just going to add that to there with a little bit of glue. And then you can get like more crazy and, you know, you can put a little straw in there. You can put a little piece there. You can put two of these on there. So that's one. And then... I'm not really going to make another one, but I did cut out a few others. Now, six by six paper doesn't really work. It cuts off part of it. So depending on what you're doing, you would have to just like either ignore that it's going to be missing a piece up at that top or just patch in a little piece. Then these two that I cut out, um, just to show you what it, what they look like, like it could be that size, but with this die, I mean, you can get so many made and I like them plain. So I am going to be, I got to get some tops or just order more. And I think Trinity also sells, I mean, you can get them on Amazon, but they sell, um, I think 10 or 12 to a package with the tops and a little thing that goes with it. So, um, but you can just get like the cups and the tops on, on Amazon, but I think I'm going to hand them out to like new people I meet down there and say, Hey, I could teach you how to do this. So that's that. And this one was also pretty. And if you turn it this way, you can do them for any, any holiday, Valentine's day anything coming up okay so let's do our card that was the coffee let's do a card let me just move some of this stuff off i'm gonna need that move that okay so i don't know this must have like popped up at me about four times in the last few days. And this was something from a couple years ago, but we're gonna do something similar. So I've got a piece of white and that is five by three and three quarters. Let me get rid of this one and the cups. Hi baby, what's the matter? You're still here. You're tickling my ankle. Okay, so I'm going to take this scrap. And each one you do comes out, you know, a little different. The set that I'm using for this is, is not that one. I don't know. I don't know. It was just here. And now it's gone. She ate it. I'm blaming it on you. Dog did it. 
All right, so I've got sponges. And I'm going to take a little bit of gray, so smoky slate. We need a little bit more than that. Smoky slate. There's one that I used before. Here's the other one. Okay, then a little glycerin. And I couldn't find my glycerin bottles. So this is like from vape juice, so it smells good. Just had to wash it out. So just a little bit of glycerin. And... Okay. Why am I getting so, so much? Am I out of frame? No, I think I'm good. All right, so we're going to make like fingerprints course. And they're going to change. It looks more like sky. Whoa. All right. So let's see how it looks when I put the tree in. All right. So when you go to do the tree, the first tree that I'm doing, we're going to take and cut part of it off. So now it looks like it's in the snow mound, is like coming up around it. And then we want to soften this a little bit. So we're going to put And then I'm just going to change it a little bit, a lot of bit. I'm going to add a little bit more. I'm going to add one more tree there, maybe two. Oh no. I think I'll go up a little higher. Okay, so now I've got those three trees. So I'm going to come in with nail polish. I'm going to come in. This is Blackberry Bliss. Hopefully that's what I used when I did that. We'll find out. But I think I need the glycerin. And who knows? I think that was purple that was on that. Something, something. All right, so I don't want it to be too dark. It's very pink. Ah, oh, it's because of what was on the sponge. Let's try that. Okay. 
Okay. Then we're going to take this little one. Now it's very dark. Before it was very pink. Now it's very dark. All right. But I don't want the tree stems. So we're going to wipe them off. And this is a Stampin' Up! blender pen that you can use for watercoloring. It's the trees in the sky because I made them too high. So I'm going to bring one down a little more. Did I not ink it? I stamped it off. What a maroon. All right, let's try that again. Huh. All right. That's better. All right, so now we're going to try and ground them a little different. Sure. Sure we are, Gail. So we're going to bring in more gray or not. I think it's going to work. And I still want to soften this up a little bit more. And then because that sky, oh, I didn't want to put it on that sponge, but it's too late, is reflecting. We'll put a little bit more there, and that'll fix it. There's like really no right and wrong. <laughs> I could sell you the bridge too. Okay. So we're done with the gray. We're done with the blackberry. Maybe I should add more trees across. Um, where's my black piece of paper? I think. So I'm going to punch out this mousse. And I'm going to put that mousse right there. First, we'll mount that. It looks amazing. It's because you're looking at it from far away. <laughs> Oh, thank you. So we're going to cover up that hole there. And when the glue leaks out, you just lick it. Okay. It does dry clear. All right. So we want to pop up this mousse. So in this last winter catalog, and they're still available, are the black dimensionals. Where's my little thing here? My tool. So they come in two sizes, the regular size and these little ones. So I'm gonna put a bunch of them. Get his ears. That's two together. That's not going to work. All 
All right, just one more over here. And then I'm going to put a little bit of glue on his feet. A little bit of glue. A dot, a dot, a dot, and a dot. And I think I'm going to put him here. And just hold that down for a second. You could actually put a couple of them. But then I want to stamp... Um, what does it say? Enjoy the stillness of the season. So, of course, I was thinking of putting it like up here, but I went too dark with the night sky. So we're going to put it right here. Okay, and then this is going to get popped up. But before I do that, I think I want to take some Winkastella and I'm going to squeeze it so I get some down. And then Oh, maybe I'll cover up the moose. Oh, it's on my glasses. I don't know how much is on the card, but it's definitely on my glasses. Okay. love it so i don't know if you can see it but there's a lot of sparkle going on there Whoop, that looked funny all right so we're going to use this up it'll be one less thing i have to carry to florida i mean like god it's great to save some space okay so proud of myself. If you only saw the stuff. Oh my God. I found something I, well, a bunch of things. I've been in this apartment for six years and I've had some tubs that I never unpacked. Yeah, it was definitely stuff that I rebought. Mm hmm. Yeah, so that's all going to be fun. I was like, I knew I had this. <laughs> I knew I had it. Six years. My other heat gun was in there. I haven't plugged it in to see if it works, but it'll be nice to have a spare. Sue, stop shaking your head, please. Okay, so then we are going to put that right there. And there's our card. Could add a few sequins, but they're packed. So I'm not. So this was it, coffee and a card, and let's see. So you can go to the main page and do that. And there's that, and where's the little coffee thing? Here it is. So there's our coffee and a card. 
And unless I pop on with some coloring um, in the evening, I will see you in two weeks. I'm going to miss all of you, but I'll be posting different things now and then. I just have to get all of this packed. So thanks for joining me, and I will see you soon. Good night, everybody.